Today I'm going to show you how to set up an AV split test in Elementor. While the existing page works great, there might be some leads or some conversions we're missing out on by just having some content in the wrong place or displayed the wrong way. For this, we're going to create a new split test. For this test, we're going to do an on-page elements. This means we can test right inside Elementor. And while this example is for Elementor, we also support blocks, baby builder, oxygen, bricks, breakdance. You can use CSS classes, JavaScript, all sorts of other things to make it nice and easy to test. We could also do a full page test with two or more pages or posts where you choose the existing page you want to test and select some alternative pages. But we're not going to do that. We're going to go with on page elements. As the conversion, which is how we're going to check to see if these changes are getting us more leads, we're going to see how often people make it to the Contact Us page. When people visit the Contact page, it will trigger a conversion and we'll know that page variation is performing better. We don't need to do much beyond that. There's a whole bunch more settings down here if we want. So now we'll go back to our page and fire up Elemental. The premise of this test that we're going to make is around these testimonials. Would it be better to have the testimonials higher up the page versus down here? And maybe there'd be a better way to display these testimonials. So let's check all these things at once. We've got a version here. We'll just select this section, go to advanced, maybe split test, and then we can go Elemental Home, and we'll call this the default version. Now if Google or a bot Someone that's not getting targeted for your test comes to the site, they will see this default version. So that's why we like to have a default version. Okay, next we're going to duplicate this section and then we'll just move it all the way up to the top. Here we go, straight from the hero into the testimonials. And again, we'll go to this section, advanced, and we'll call this top. All right, next we'll come back down to where this existing testimonial is, but we'll just change this format up a little bit. So again, we'll duplicate this row. And we'll just take the one. And we've done that. So again, we'll just apply the test to this section. There we go. And we'll call this simple because it's a simple layout of testimonials. Okay, now we're done. We'll hit update. And it doesn't have to be sections. You can swap out headings, images, any element or block that you like. Interchanging doesn't need to be the same content that you're swapping out. Okay, so now that's published, we can visit our page. Now we've done all that, our test is active. Because we're logged in admins, we're gonna see the default version. But you can go to your admin bar here to toggle between the default, the simple version, or if we scroll all the way up here, we can see the top version. And it's all very simple from there. You can click here to see your test results once they start coming in. So let's give this a few days and see what we come up with. Okay, we're back a few days later. And as you can see by the confetti, we have gathered enough information and declared a winner. The top variation with the testimonial at the top has a 1.66% conversion rate compared to the others. And with this much information, we now know for sure that this is a better version. Since we know this, AB Split Test has implemented the winning version automatically, so you don't need to do anything else. The winning variation is being shown to everyone to make sure that you get high conversions as soon as possible. There is a ton more that you can do with AB Split Test to improve your WordPress website conversions. Take a look at absplittest.com to see how it can work for you.